I am lucky enough to be an art teacher here at the elementary school. And I shared my favorite book with the school, which is the great book by Pete Seeger, Abba Yo-Yo. Here's a quick snapshot. The boy and his father, the giant Abba Yo-Yo. The boy and his father get rid of the giant and everyone is so happy. The ukulele saves the day. And you can make your own ukulele out of cardboard and sandpaper in the journal that is supplied with this program. There is a page that has the outline of a ukulele and you can outline it on a piece of paper like this if you'd like and then put it on a piece of cardboard. You wanna use like a heavier paper, a cardboard, and then trace that design of the ukulele onto the cardboard. Then you'll cut out that cardboard ukulele and we have some beautiful, beautiful designs on the ukuleles. Let me show you a few of them. So many beautiful designs from all the students. And here's a beautiful design right here. So now that the design is on the ukulele, we'll take the sound hole, which is made out of sandpaper, and we're gonna glue that right onto the front of the ukulele. After the glue dries on the sound hole, you get another piece of sandpaper, which is your pick, and the sandpaper acts as the sound. So you've got a little ukulele made out of cardboard and a little bit of sandpaper. So you've got your beautiful ukulele. You put all the designs on it that you want. You've got your sandpaper sound hole, and you also cut out the pick for your ukulele. Now, notice this is just a little piece of sandpaper, and if I use it like this, that's okay. It's not terrible. Getting some sound, but watch this. You take your pick, your sandpaper, and then fold it in half. Fold it in half, and now the edge that is the sandpaper edge, here's the open edge, I'm gonna hold that in my fingers, and then the sandpaper edge is the one I wanna to use to make sound. Listen now. Quite a bit more sound. And also when I hold it, I'm holding the pick so that it can be flexible right here. When I stroke. <laughs> and after you've got your ukulele made, you've been playing it with your pick, I think it's really nice if you have some type of case for it. And your ukulele and sandpaper would go very well in an envelope. Make sure you get your, your pick in there. Give yourself a couple extra picks. Uh, picks are always getting lost, so give yourself a few extra picks. Put them into your envelope, and that will be the case because we wanna learn how to take care of our instruments and, you know, play them on another day. So you've got the case, you've got your ukulele in there, you got your picks in there. Now go over to grandma's house and play her some songs.